Here's your field on parade for tonight's fifth race. Number one is Scoot and Ashley, owned by Larry Adams with Randy Tharps. Two horses discovering gold, owned by the Sugar Knoll Farms. Brian Sears drives for Brian Brown. Three is out. Four is She's Reed Indeed, owned by Charles Geiler with Sandy Beatty. Five horses, Emma and Emily, owned by Nixon and Boggs with David Myers. Six horses, Robert Hastings, Zoo, and Jeff Fout. Seven, Come On Cammy is owned by Jerry Summers with Jack Daly. The eight is Patiwa Creek, owned by Bowling, Ricks, and Hayner with Ron Steck. Number nine, Late Breaking News, owned by Russo and Parker with Kevin Sizer. The ten is out. That's your field. Post time is in six minutes. Post time. They're off. Phillies and mares let go for a mile, and Scoot and Ashley is out fast. Late breaking news from the extreme outside. She's Reed indeed is there with Zoo between horses. They're four wide as they make their way around the far turn. Discovering Gold gets away racing in fifth. Two and a half lengths back to Emma and Emily, followed by Come On Cami and Patiwa Creek. Around the turn to the quarter pole, and she's Reed indeed grabs the early lead. Zoo settling into second. Late breaking news was caught three wide there, grabs the three hole, followed by Scoot and Ashley and discovering gold as they wheel past the opening quarter in 28 and one fifths. Passing the stands for the first time, she's Reed indeed and Sandy Beatty. They're showing the way just over a length from Zoo. Late breaking news away well, just two lengths further back in third, followed by Scoot and Ashley fourth. Discovering Gold wanted no part of the early battle and is racing fifth. Next up, it's Emma and Emily. Come on, Cammy and Patiwa Creek. Around the turn, they go to the half mile pole, and she's Reed indeed. 12 to 1 long shot is showing the way. She's Reed indeed on top, just over length. Zoo is just sitting there in the pocket, second, followed at the inside by late breaking news. Scoot and Ashley is first up with a rush, and they're by the half in 59 seconds flat. 30 and 4, pretty leisurely second split for the long shot. She's Reed indeed, who continues on the lead up the back stretch and opens up now by two. Scoot and Ashley on the outside pokes her nose in front of Zoo, who's battling back towards the rail. Second over is Discovery. Discovering Gold, followed by Late Breaking News. There goes Emma and Emily, three wide with a bid, three off the pace, followed by Come On Cami and Patiwa Creek. They are very compact, only about five lengths cover the field. She's Reed Indeed, three quarters, one, twenty, nine, and four. She's Reed Indeed on top, just over length. Zoo is saving all the ground in second. Emma and Emily is three wide, not making much ground up, though. On the far outside, Come On Cami is closing with a rush, and Patiwa Creek will fan out five wide in the drive to the wire. They make their way into the stretch, and they're all starting to come after She's Reed Indeed. It's She's Reed Indeed on top. Zoo's been saving ground, now dries up the inside. Emma and Emily is there. Discovering Gold finds a seam, and here comes Patiwa Creek. Best of all on the far outside, Patiwa Creek getting up. She's Reed Indeed, Emma and Emily. The circle for the second time this season is the eight, Patiwa Creek. This is a three-year-old Bay Philly by Tucson Hanover from Pet Ua Lucinda by Big Towner. It's owned by Sarah Bowling, Deborah Ricks, and Tony Ann Hayner. Tony Ann Hayner, the trainer, and Ron Steck pilots this one to victory. Two minutes, and that's good for a new lifetime mark. Exact eight four, two hundred ninety-two dollars and twenty cents. The try eight four five, one thousand six ninety-seven forty.